All right. Hi, everyone. I'm Kale Johnston. I'm the founder and CEO of ClickSwitch. ClickSwitch was founded in 2014 to help customers switch their bank accounts. But our business model is very easy. We're actually B2B to C. So we partner with financial institutions in US and Canada. We have about 400 financial institutions using ClickSwitch to help their customers switch over their reoccurring payments and their direct deposits from their old account over to their new account. A process that once took 60 to 90 days for a customer to switch over can now take about five to 10 minutes with what we're gonna show you here today. So there's three easy steps which Adam's gonna go through. First, we need your customer to go in and tell us who pays them to get their direct deposit switched. And then we're gonna go in and get the recurring payments switched as well. So once the account's funded and the direct deposit's now pointed at their new checking account, we wanna get the recurring payments switched over from their old account. So like I said, we first just need to understand who pays them. We use a Google API on the front end, so any business you can switch or search within Google, you can find within ClickSwitch. So we're gonna switch from, let's say I work at the University of North Texas, I'm gonna type in uh, my employer, which is University of North Texas, click continue. We have a, we have a back-end database that's full of employers and depositors uh, and merchants from all over the country. We built this basically one by one with each financial institution. During the implementation process, they send us their ACH report. And so we cross-reference the billers that are in our database to what they're sending us to make sure the customer's having a great experience as soon as they go through. So we look like we need to, need, need to know the customer uh, account number right here, employee ID. They enter it. They need to tell ClickSwitch which account this needs to be deposited into because when they open their account, it looks like they set up a joint checking account. We need to select the account. So when they opened your account, it looks like they had a checking account and savings account set up with you. And then the customer, which really makes this unique, they could pick the percentage pay or amount that they want to transfer in on a recurring basis to your account. Uh, so we're going to transfer every, every time I get paid, 75% of my paycheck is going to go into my new bank account. And just to, just to confirm, we're going to hit a confirm page here uh, before they submit to make sure everything looks good because once they hit submit, the next time they get paid, 75% of their paycheck is going to go into their new checking account. So we just set that up, the direct deposit switch is on the way. Again, now that that's funded, we need to get the payments switched over from their old account to their new account. We're using account aggregation on the front end here. So the, comp the, the customer simply tells us who is their old bank that they want to switch away from. Uh, they type in click switch credit union, just do something standard here. We need to know uh, the customer's username and password to their old account because right now we're going to log into their old account and we're going to look for frequency and velocity of the payments and parse out what's a recurring payment that's transacted on a monthly, weekly, or quarterly or yearly basis that we can recognize that is set up there to be pulled so the next time the merchant comes and gets paid, it's set up on their new account. We recognize two recurring payments here. It looks like A plus auto and the, and the wireless. We click on it. And now we're just gonna go through. So it, again, it's a conversational API that you're getting right here. So it's pinging our database and we know what A plus auto needs in order to get this payment set up. And it looks like they need to know their account number with A plus auto. We'll hit continue. And now we're gonna go over to the wireless and the wireless needs to know some, so again, so now we're pulling the da database there. And so the unique identifier there is their wireless number. A plus auto was the account number. So what you're getting here is every single merchant, we know the unique verified uh, lines in order to get them switched over. Again, you're hitting a confirmation page here. So before you hit submit, does this look right? Adam hits submit. Uh, and we made the switch. So a process that used to took 60 to 90 days and led to a lot of your customers abandoning the process of getting switched over to you can now get switched over in about five to 10 minutes. So we hope you swing by our booth. We did this in four minutes. So. That's great. Uh, we're, we're in the back corner over there. I hope you swing by your booth. You can also go to clickswitch.com, request a demo. Uh, we can go more in depth over this, uh, but we hope you found this enjoyable, and thank you very much.